guys, welcome to another lesson of Pro Teaches Noob. Today I have with me, first time in quite a while actually, Bianca. Hey, glad to be back. And today we're going to start what's going to be a big read through. Not just with this one story, but in general. We're going to start my favorite era of the Hulk. From Planet Hulk to Red She-Hulk. Ooh. And we're going to start right off with Planet Hulk. Now, depending on how long it takes me to get through this, we might do this in five chap FSU installments, or I can try and get it all done in one go. Let's wait and see. We will wait and see on this one. But, yeah, let me just add. So you're, you've become a bit of a Hulk fan, haven't you? Or have you always been a Hulk fan? Uh, She-Hulk, specifically. Right. Um, I guess it's, it, uh, the spark kind of hit with uh, the Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Ah. The but you've been worlds. aware of Planet Hulk, right? Not until much later. Have you ever seen the animated movie? Yeah. There's a lot from the animated movie. No. Oh. And, and yet a lot changed as well. So let's get started and see where this takes us. All right. Time and time again, your anger and power has threatened the entire planet. So when we learned that Fury sent you into space, we had to seize the opportunity. I, I always thought about his friends, Bruce. So I am truly, genuinely sorry. But for your sake and ours, we're sending you away. It's the only way we can be sure. Hulk then busts out, causing the ship to go crazy, go into a wormhole, and then crash on the planet we would soon know it as Sakaar. Heck, Sakaar! I, yep, I know you must hate us, Bruce, but I believe in my heart that this may be the greatest opportunity of your life. We picked your destination carefully. A lush planet full of vegetation and game, but no intelligent life form. There will be no one there to hurt you, and no one you can hurt. You always said you wanted to be left alone. May you finally find peace. Obviously, this wasn't the planet they wanted to send him to, obviously. Stupid bug! Just like the humans! <laughs> Don't you get it? You could tear your crummy world... I could tear, tear your crummy world in, world in half. You can't beat me. You can't even... Doom! Hurt? Me? Rawr! Yeah, apparently they have weapons that can hurt the Hulk. Nice. Naratara. Huh? Shira Ho, first one I've seen who can even stand who can even stand after passing through. Enough. Judging by the comically moronic expression of surprise spreading over your face, I assume the talk bots have reached your brain. So and so hear ye, hear ye. I am the governor of the Wak Wukar province, and by order of our crown prince and hero protector, the Lord Emperor of Sakar, all Dietrus in which exit the Great Portal is henceforth designated as Imperial property. Therefore, I claim this, this isn't right. First picking to first kit finders. That's forever been law. The law has changed. The red and king promised his war destroyed our crops. And now the wild and wilde bots are coming. The life of our hive depends upon the right to enough. Now kneel. The hive, the hive will die. We, will, we all have our problems. Now you, oh hideous green one. We're all impressed by your ability to remain upright after passing through the life-draining energies of the Great Portal. So your ship will go to our scientists for further study, and you'll learn how to serve your emperor. Let's begin with lesson one. On your knees. Always somebody yelling. You want the ship? It's yours! But the Hulk doesn't kneel! Oh! Shot and knocked out. Close <laughs> enough. Uh, uh. We'll start the auction with these three natives, Kem Bonded and Neutered. They're entering voluntary servitude to raise money for their starving hive. Plucks and plucks at the old heartstrings, don't it? Bidding starts at 15 silver squares. Buy us. And, and, and please buy us. Buy us that our hive may live. Taking it, it, e it easy, big man. You're fresh and freshling from Portal. Not so strong. Shut up. I'm the strongest one. Rawr! Whoa, and the slumbering beauty awakens. Don't worry, folks. He can't break those shadow and forge chains, but it's cute watching him try, huh? <laughs> 60 for the lot. Sold! Although, to be honest, I probably would have paid you to take the green greenie off my hands. 
little too uh, unreconciled, see, reconciled, you know? That's why I want him. Basically, Hulk is on a world full of monsters who can handle monsters. <laughs> the first X needs a little juice. Stupid planet, stupid portal, you think you can make me weak, but I've already gained stronger, and when I get my hands on... Huh? Boring, Governor. Boring. Any death's head in the guard could rip through an old cage. I thought you had something new. Patience here, Eminence. And now, citizens and oligarchs, are act one of the day's festivities, an exciting and educational interlude, wherein we shall investigate the feeding habits of our planet's most ferocious predators. Feeding habits? The carnivorous Mozars, more commonly known as the Great Double Corker, thrives in the plains and deserts of Upper Vandro, where the natives live in fear of its lethal tentacles and spiked projectile tongues. Hey! This is that's new, isn't it? Not bad. By the hive, he gave his life. Forget, forget your hive's soft shells. Now's the time to dodge and for dodging, running, hiding, smashing. Stupid two-hander. We're getting back to boring, Governor. My apologies, Your Eminence. I'm sure the second act will. Roar! Oh. Hmm. This is the end. So be it, be it for the hive, for the hive, we give our lives, stupid jackworms. Gah, outcast, unclean, we will not kim with you, unhiver. Never ask for kimming, you dumb cringes, and just shutting up and running. Ha! Thanks for helping, two hands. You trying to trick me, you little bunk? Hey, hey, no more fighting, it's all, all been over. Listen, the big cheers for us. <laughs> No humping, the Red King, Red King, the pardoning us now. Red King, the Emperor, his planet, we're just living here. He runs this stupid world as much as me, he gra and grabbing anyway. Finally. Hey. Oh. Hope knows who to smash. Damn. Just so, in just a moment, my lord. No way. I'll take care of this one myself. You could have been pardoned. I might have even made you a citizen, but you tried to kill me instead. And for that, your emperor thanks you, because this is going to be fun. King! It's up to you, monster. Die on your feet, or take it on your knees. Rawr! Don't disappoint me now. You can't win with brute force. I'm the strongest one there is. If you want and to have any kind of chance, you have to be smarter. Faster. Like so. P -p pardon Oh, and so. Pardon us, king and so, and so. K killer Back off, Bug! He's mine! Tisk tisk. The monster doesn't learn. Yeah? He cut him. Wh what? Hulk slash! Drop your sword! Forget it! Don't be stupid. I'm a war-bound and bound shadow. You're a quick study, but you can't beat me. This isn't your world. Not yet. <laughs> May he who dies die well. Ja! This and this fight was mine. Who? No, no, Lieutenant. Can't have my shadow uh, upstage me, can I? Behold! The Lord Emperor and Hero Protector, the Prince of Sakaar, grants this slave his life. He bled you, my lord, in front of the crowd. Is it wise to let him live? Who said anything about letting him live? He's going straight to the maw. Okay, listen to me. Nobody looking out the window. Oh, no. I said no looking! No, 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 no. What are you crying about? This is going to be fun. So what did you see <laughs> on that start? Oh, that was great. Oh, it was made 1999? Yep. No, no. Oh, uh, yeah. 99. No, no. That's no. when the issue started. It was published in 2006. Notice. Okay. 90, issue 93. So the run oh. started in 99. Okay. I gotcha. So, what did you, but yeah, talk about a great start, huh? Yeah, that was fantastic. Be honest, what do you think about my, the voices I've been giving these guys? For the series in general, or for your entire Pro Teachers noobs? Right here, just for this. Oh, you have personality. That's what I always <laughs> think. Thanks. Especially with Hulk, right? Hulk yeah. smash! Yes, of course. 
But yeah, we're seeing them getting word already about what that he slashed the um the king, which is getting people already talking about like if he could do it, what could happen next? Team captain, come in. Team sec and team second and third. Anyone? Frats? Ha! You won't be laughing when it's incinerating you, big guy. You're right, because it won't live that long. Warned you, dummy. But thanks for saving my can. Did it do it for you? I just felt like fighting. I, uh, I, I see you haven't lost your spirit, but it won't do you much good if you stay so stupid. Now, Neil. Tired of hearing that. Neil. Like, Give it up, chief. You've been implanted with an obedience slug. Fight it too hard and it'll fry your brain. If the, that is, if you have any, it up. You're slave to the emperor. Accept it. I am Primus Bond. And basically, yeah, explains how he's one of the uh, undefeated champions of the gladiators. And it's the, this is their most lethal gladiatorial training school. And the mall must be fed. School. So in other words, he's starting from the ground up. As one should. He ain't getting no special privileges. Nope. <laughs> So basically, you, you, criminals, traitors, slaves, monsters, no one on this planet believes you deserve to live. Who among you will prove them wrong? 22 have entered this field. Only seven will leave it. This is insane. I'm a citizen of the empire, an elected representative in the community college and Congress. Does the law mean nothing? I demand you know that I am charged with. And what I'm charged with, I demand to know what I'm charged with. I demand a trial. I demand, damn, fight or die. Damn. And turns out Miek is actually a good strategist. Everyone staying close. Now fighting together like before. Right, two hands? Get away from me. Come on, you. Bleeding. All of us needing everyone and something else. Strange. Pink man saying 22, but Miek only counting 16. Shut up, bug. The grown-ups are talking. <laughs> and hold, friend. If we fight work together, we can... Fine! Two hands! Uh, brood! We Ooh. are brood from Brood World. You are lunch. So have a sandwich! Thanks, two hands. Three times you saving me now. Good friend to Miek. Not your friend! Not anyone's friend. I knowing you just saying that. No, he means it. And that's why he'll die. Stop! You seven have survived the cut. From now on, you're a team. So we got the war bound. Uh, tomorrow it gets worse. Nah, watch it. If none of us can pull it off, what makes you think you can? It won't last long, you tiny bug. Please, I'm minding your own business. All alone. No more hive mates to protect you. So sad. So sad. Never having hive. Never needing one. But you, I'm smelling it. Calling out for your sisters, but no answering. They're being dead. You're the one who won't last long. <laughs> Ching! I'm Korg. I could crush any one of you. But if I did, we'll be one man short tomorrow. And then we all might die. Like it or not, we're depending upon each other now. So let's talk. This is what, what I prefer, Korg. And I do not care for the Korg we've been getting in the Thor movies. Yeah, it's been a super long time since I uh, watched the movie. Name and skills. I I being meek, unhived and not caring. Skills? Forehand fighting, stealing, hiding, skulking. What about you, forehand? I am brood from Brood World, which is no more. No queen, no sisters, no name. You've seen what I can do. And you? He won't talk to us. He's an unbound shadow, still in his desert gear. His days are, are silence and prayer. But when and but when the time comes, he'll fight like nothing you've ever seen. I'm Captain Lavinsky, formerly of the Imperial Guard. My employer was Ronan Cave, a citizen of the Empire and representative of the 5th Re Regional Community Congress, the man the trainer killed. My father. Can the little one fight? My name is Eloi. And no, I don't know much about fighting. But I'll learn. Good. No, stupid. You say we can't survive on our own, so we have to fight together as a team. That's right. But we've all seen how this world works. What happens when it's time to kill each other? We both know what happens then. But until that day, we're friends. Wake me up when it's time to fight. So, friends? Y yeah. 
What's a sandwich, anyway? <laughs> there, in the lava. Whatever they are, they're big, green skin. We'll double team them, man. It's Karg's, um, other, his other fellow men and people. But they have been so controlled by these things that they're brain dead now. Was that rock thing from uh, Ragnarok? Th these are, uh, the, uh, well, Korg is from Ragnarok, and these are his fellow kind. Ah, the, cl uh, I was going to say clansmen. No, uh, freak, I forgot the name. But yeah, they're taking them all down because there's nothing left. I'll smash them! Lord, I am your rockling. Forgive me and protect me. That's him, all right. What do you think? The truth? I'm scared to hell. <laughs> now, Miak not getting fe Why Miak not getting feathers? Feathers are for soft skins. <laughs> listen up and listen and listen. And shut up and listen. We'll be at the next site soon. You're glad he is now. Make the most of it. Korg? They would have killed us all. He uh, And he did what had to be done. You, rockling the stone, stone the sand. Are, are, are all your people so... Are, are, are all your people being so strong, two hands? I don't have any people. And you're well. No more like you? No. Just humi, puny little humans. Like Banner. Banner? You'll never see his face. He wouldn't last a minute on this planet. He's even weaker than you. Ha! <laughs> weaker than me. I'd like to be seeing that. You might not. Humans are quite weak as he, aren't as quite weak as he pretends. As he pretends. Humans and humans. His pe and his people. I've eaten a few. In the future, visually, they're practically defenseless. But with their machines and their heroes, they can overcome considerable challenges. Their machines and heroes won't save them. From what? Hey, an Imperial pleasure cruiser. Come to see our blood. Or, or theirs. No, no, no. Those are just farmers. We're not. We're not killing those people. We'll do what we have to. But we have bigger problems than your farmers. Last week, the fierce green gladiators earned his first wound for the emperor himself. Now, after a stint in the maw, let's see how he does against the Shaylin Plains, most lethal packs of will to beaten bots. Oh boy! Leading into more action. As yep, they take down all of them. So. Basically, as you probably guess, um, Planet Hulk is just like the movie Gladiator. And Which I haven't seen. <laughs> yep, but now they're celebrating as they're all eating. Delicious. Mm-hmm. And while well, they're dealing with all the other pleasantries. Well, well, indeed. I might be able to give a word to your father's allies. Oh, just go. <laughs> Um, but, um, but the, um, his shadow, um, Chayera is trying to tell him that the, pe she's trying to warn him the people are talking and he's not listening. <laughs> All of a sudden, boom, green scar, green scar. We are the Sakaar democratic insurgency. We fight for the outcast, the slave, the discarded and despised. We fight for you. Will you fight for us? No, I will not fight for you. Actually, you're not far off. <laughs> um, so yeah, LOA is ready to join in, but um, yeah, they're trying to say, "Come with us, Green Scar, and we'll tear and tear the Emperor from his throne." Hulk doesn't want to join in. Do and do what you want. I'm gonna finish my dinner. What's the matter with you? The rebels, they're the only ones trying to fix this frazzed up world. They need us. You don't get it, do you? Puny pinkies, like puny humans. First they call us monsters. Then they come crying for help. Then they call us monsters again. Enemy secured? No, she's with us. No, I'm not. What happened? Where's Eloway? I should never have left her alone. There was nothing you could have done, Ski. It was my duty, Korg. I, she chose her past. Yes, and she's the only one who chose correctly. Ski, you're an offlander, so maybe you don't care. But 30,000 citizens have disappeared since the Emperor took the throne. At least that's as many as they counted. So far, vanished without a trace. And that doesn't include the hundreds of thousands of slaves and foreign soldiers who've died in his wars. Ours. I was with the Imperial Guard. Those rebels would kill me on sight. But I thought it could help them. I cut off my own right hand. You and all right, young buds. Enough crazy talk for one night. 
Your fight with the will of the bots made the premier view box feed. The Imperial League has taken notice. So get some sleep. Tomorrow you hit the big time. So they're going going out to get some pleasantry. And Sierra is there. Finally. Ah! Ha! You're, uh, you're going to try to kill me every time we meet, Lieutenant? I'm the Emperor's Shadow. I need to know its enemies. You're getting faster. And stronger. Maybe. But I could still cut off your head. And I'd rip you in half before it hit the ground. Maybe another time. So what are you here for? You're a problem for the Emperor, as long as you're in the public eye. I'm here to buy you. I'll take you to the steeps, a place of peace. You'll never have to fight again. Heard that one before. No thanks. Think again, Screen Scar. You'll always be a monster to them. Yeah, but these guys know what a monster likes. As they're making their way back up again into the main Imperial um, Gladiator Challenge. And, but um, Hulk, uh, uh, they're ready to drop. Oh, jeez, a um, a nuke on everyone. Yes, dang. Okay, yeah, everyone's confused. Like, what is he doing? Unbelievable! That was a precision death fire bomb detonating in the middle of the great arena of the center of the Crown City against gladiators armed only with shields and swords. That's a gross re re violation of the rules. I've never, never seen. I'll take, I take that. Hey, what are you? Let's go. They're ready to, to kill them all. Kill them all. Kill them all. Yep. And but then Hulk is there and he may. Like, enemy down. Enemy down. Enemy down. No. Enemy mad. Enemy <laughs> mad. Enemy mad. Enemy mad. Roar! Yeah. With but one arm left, he raised your sword. We commend, commend you to oh, to you, O oh prophet. Forgive him and embrace him. Oh, the guy got, um, Ski got stabbed. Oh, um, oh my gosh, no. Tomorrow, we dying too, huh? If it is our time. Don't listen to him, little bug. You saw much today, but I've seen far worse and lived to tell the tale. Basically, they were fighting against some of their great enemies, uh, but at the same time, Brood Warrior got destroyed long ago. But they survived because one of the creatures they fought, they were fighting in, actually, they killed it off, but it was so giant, they were able to use it as its carcass. It saved their lives, and they used it as a vessel to move through space until they eventually landed on Sakaar. We then Korg... He was one of the stone warriors that fought Thor in his very first appearance. <laughs> Great artwork here. And we then see, uh, but yeah, to get a little description a bit more with um, you know, Hulk's describes about Banner. And um, Nick all alone, hiding in the alleys, creeping and skulking and stealing. Nobody helping him. Nobody caring. Matter of the fact, everyone trying to killing him or slaving him. Until Miek meeting you, which we then summarize everything we've been up to. To which then we're told, like, let us be warbound. As then they become, you know, yeah, warbound, as in they would fight together, and yeah. Oh, and his name is Hirium. Oh, but look, Surfer's been captured. No. Or yay. I don't know. <laughs> now we're going to get to that, the big fight. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Let's -a go. Let's -a go. Yahoo. Hee <laughs> hee. <laughs> yep. So yeah, I, all right. By the prophet. Yes, he tends to get that kind of reaction, but he looks just like the son of remarkable, isn't it? But don't worry, Lieutenant. The emperor says the old stories are nothing but lies, right? You, speak. Where did you come from? Who? Who are you? Make him talk. You heard her, slave. You want my story? Basically, he explains his origin. And then how eventually he got surprised and captured and forced to fight. But for this gift, I hate you. Almost as much as I hate myself. Because he's actually been feeling enjoyment doing what he's been doing. What a weirdo. Now, now this eventually is about ready to lead into 
We had Green Scar. He and his mob of monsters survived the mall, smashed the Wildabots, and won their first two rounds in the Great Arena. But just who are these horrific heroes? Let's give it up for them. Did he just say, hor oh, horrific heroes? Horrific heroes, yeah. <laughs> I I was, I heard, like, heroific heroes or something right. like that. And I'm like, wait, that sounds weird. Oh, I love this. And don't forget commemorative banners, posters, and shirts. Hey, Miak want the shirt! <laughs> <laughs> They're looking over the, um, the shield ship, but it's not giving them much to go off of. Of course... And the king realizes that in doing this, he will martyr the Hulk. But he's just a monster. Let him die like one. As we then see the Silver Savage. Surfer, is that you? Yes. You know him? Yeah. Then pray for him. They painted him to look like the son of Sakaar. Made him an abomination of the eyes of... That's not paint. He's the Silver Surfer. He's my... Friend? A -pum! You lousy punk! I thought you were different, but you're just like the rest of them. Forgive me. Wasn't he? And wasn't he saying all puny humans being weak? I told you he was exaggerating. Shut up and get ready. Goodbye. By the hive. Damning it. He can be cut, and he can't be cut. And everyone, stay back, all. And give him another pass, and we'll be dead. I only, I see only one. I only see one spot. Go for it. Go high. Aim true, bondsman. Oh! Stabbing him right in the, um... In the control desk. You broke the disc. I'm free. Thank you. Boom! <laughs> oh, pounding on him. Like, Hulk, no, Hulk, no. We've won. We've surrounded three rounds. Three rounds in the great arena. Give us our freedom! It's over, your eminence. Not just yet. You've survived three rounds, but the green scar slashed the face of the Emperor himself. So you must face one final test of loyalty. These are enemies of your Emperor. Iloe Cafe, your friend, a high-born Imperior, and a traitor. Killer and you go free. Bad joke. I wish it were. Now, Primus. And don't fight it, Greeny. You're still wearing your obedience disc, remember? Nobody tells the Hulk. Always the hard way, huh? Enough. Even you can't stop this. Just tell me one thing. Lavin, Ski, my father's god, where he he who died, died well. You killed him? No. Lavin, Ski fought by her side, fell in battle. We are his warbound. And so we invoke the warbound provision of the Shadow Pact. Our brother served this woman. We cannot fight her. Force her hand and you break the treaty between the Shadow and the Empire. I know you, Hiriam, the shamed. You gave up your right to invoke the Shadow Pact when you first broke your bond. That bond was broken before you and I ever took it, Kyera, the old strong. Speak treason. So be it. But I will not fight this girl. Whatever. Ah! But thanks to Surfer, the discs are destroyed. All of them! No. No more slave. Only free people now. Tied only and tied only. Only by the bonds they have chosen. Free. <laughs> what? Now, what do you think? We tear this mother down! Oh! Oh, I... The disc prevented me from using my power cosmic. But still, I'm too weak. Something about this planet, or the portal through which I flew, I must end return to the stars. Will you come? <laughs> Back when we first met, that's all I wanted. I hated the stupid humans. They never left me alone. When I saw you in the sky... Thought you were a flying saucer. I wanted to catch you, make you take me to another world. I'm sorry. If I had known, let me take you now. You don't get it. I'm finally here. You staying too, huh, Silver Skin? There is a story of the Sakar son. He, he, he comes to save us. When we first saw you, I thought that you... I have heard these stories. They also speak of the world breaker who comes to destroy. I cannot stay. He thinks that means it'll be Galactus. Nor should you, my friend. You say you want to be left alone. But here, they'll never stop. So long, surfer. So be it. Be well. No. Be good. As, they fly, as he flies off. And it turns out the Hulk's blood is actually causing things to grow again. Ooh. Can so how was that? 
Oh, I felt like it was so short. <laughs> Come on, come on. Refresh, refresh, refresh. <laughs> and the way we're going, I think I can get through a good chunk. And we might be able to get through everything. Probably. It's going faster than I thought it would be. It's a lot of action, that's why. Makes sense. Okay, this first opens up with a story from Peter David, but that's not what we're here to focus on. <gasps> I'm telling Peter David. <laughs> well, we're here to focus on Planet Hulk. Fine. Here we go. Exiled from Earth, enslaved on an alien planet, stabbed, slashed, scarred, then thrown onto the bloody sand where you had to smash with all your strengths as to survive. It's like a dream come true for you, isn't it? Even made some new friends. Monsters. Nightmares. Just like you. But that's all over now. Because I'm back. Banner. That's right, Hulk. I found you. Like I always will. Now get up. No. Who Who you talking to, two hands? Come on, Hulk. Ugh. We're going home. Come on. This is ridiculous. Where are you? And anyway, where are you? You know how it works. You unriled, and then I clean things up. We're in that second stage now, so... Hey! Bruce, I found you. Jorella? No, this isn't real. This isn't your world. And you're dead. You've been dead for... Bruce! Oh, okay, I get it. You're dreaming, Hulk. Look, look at you. Living these old stories again. Ugh! This is embarrassing. You're not, you're not real, Hulk. None of this is real. Are you listening to me, Hulk? Like, I, no, I, no. Think back, Hulk, on Jorella's world. It was me in your body, remember? Bruce, she fell in love with me, not you. Jarella, never you. Jarella, who's that laughing? No one laughs. No one laughs at Hulk. Oh, gee. oh, he rips Hulk right, and, and Iron Man legs in half, just like um Ultimate Wolf and uh, Hulk did the Ultimate Wolverine. Better him than me. <laughs> oh, now everyone's like, it's clobbering time and try clobbering time. Try slobbering. Bruce, no, 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 no. Hey, wait, Jarella, Jarella. Too late. She's gone. She's dead. And that's how it all and how it ends. How it will always end. There's no place for you on this planet or any other because you do, and just don't know how to behave because you're a monster. But you're all you're also me. Let me take and take over. I'll find the ship. I'll fix it. We'll go to the planet Reed wanted us to go to, where we'll be alone. You like that, wouldn't you, Banner? Get me into that ship where you could do anything you wanted to? Blow it up? Fly it in the sun, maybe? Yeah, I got you figured out. Because I'm you, remember? But with one difference. You're all alone. No, I'll always have you. I did it. I, I won. I... Two hands? Wah. Two hands. Miek thinking he... Seeing. Don't worry, Miek. No one here but us monsters. What'd what you think of that? What what just happened? Banner was fighting for in control. He got it for a moment, but soon realized the Hulk is right. There's nothing for him. Oh, that's pretty sick, freaking sad. <laughs> oh, and this is a reprint of Hulk the End. We've already been over that. Mm hmm. So I'm just breathing past through all this. I mean, that was a great story, wasn't it? Yeah. But like I said, we've already been over it. Come on, come on. There we go. So five down, ten more to go. As we're seeing more and more people feel like we're free, we're free. Although then they start insulting me ex people a bit. Um, like, ain't not kidding, liar. <laughs> he telling you ain't telling you now. Two hands never eating nobody. Don't be so sure. The more that puny pinky talks, the hungrier I get. 
Yeah, you keep running, badmouth. I could go after him. No. It's, uh, it's so now, now you being the green scar, feeling better? He, he said he was hungry. Don't worry, he likes sandwiches. What's a <laughs> sandwich? Running gag! Like, the camp's completely vulnerable on low ground. In a valley, but basically, yeah, explain how there's a valley between them. And, um, yeah, Sierra is trying to figure out what to do, realizing that this will cause more problem for the king. Also, we're then seeing, um, they're about to do some bombardment. Oh, no. Why are you, are you running? There's nobody here but us monsters. Yeah! And, yeah, the bombing didn't do so well. It was a decoy, Governor, Dis and dispersed the trackers. I've already, I already have, but the bombs have destroyed any track of the entire valley. We're back where we started. Just a moment, old strong. There's something, Governor. What is it, Lieutenant? Get ready. Is it the green? I. Oh, there you are, Governor and Denebo. What are you doing? Just dealing with some local villagers. They were hiding food from the army. Have to keep up our standards. And I thought it might add a little bait to your trap. In cold blood. Last time they'll ever have the chance. There's only a dozen of them. Let's go, Hulk. Wait. Like, if your enemy invites you in. What? Look to the far ridge, Eloy. More of them. So, in other words, they know. I love that. If your enemy invites you in. In other words, if it seems like an opening, don't take it. If we're going to survive, we need to learn about strategy. And these slaves need to learn about war. We need a place to train. Meek, knowing where. Oh, jeez, those will the bots again. Stand firm. Up as they head in, I started helping these people out. How can we trust them, headman? We are Imperials, after all. And when push comes to shove, we'll die here, whether we help these gladiators or not. Forget about the Empire. The Red King doesn't care about us. So again, more and more they are in Hulk, whether he means to or not, are influencing and inspiring these people. Nice. I can smell it. The cheem's still in the air, even of these years. A hive. Your hive. I see. Well, in my head, Mick, stupid bug, he's chemming the native way, sending us his visions. Can you see them? As we see Miek when he grew up and there's his father. And basically things go bad and he ran off and he's been hiding ever since. Denying himself. But we saw his memories. Yes, you my hive now. So now I'm calling you for justice. You headman, you killing my father, my brothers, my whole family. Now you baying. Nobody touches my father. Stop it, child. No father. They can't, they... They're right. I rubbed out his hive. The Emperor's orders. Exterminate the natives. Establish Imperial ownership of his vital resources. But these are old crimes. Unconnected to the threats we jointly face together. Um, they say, what say you? Twelve hours to repair our bodies in Seoul, and then we meet here to make an end. Your end! So, yeah. <laughs> you teach, uh, teach them how to fight. I... On. And Miek, a word for go. Not understanding. This man is an ally. Now, let the past... No, talking about my fathers, my brothers, you not understanding. Think again, little one. I... I... We are your brothers now. Two hands. What you... What's saying you? Why, you ask me. You know what you want. You brought us here to get it. But what... What would you be doing? I never stop making them pay... Like, so, yeah, they're getting ready, and turn out some of his people are still there. Ooh. Like, yield, not stopping, you'll die. Never, chops off his own arm to win the fight. <laughs> Do it. Ay! Revealing that there's more of his people. Miek, Miek, brother Miek, brother Miek. Uh, he was there, old strong. No more than three hours ago. You, headman, have you seen... Basically, they, sh they brought down the entire place. Good. Uh, I'll be right back. Okay.
I'm gonna have to remove a big chunk. Sorry, guy into an <laughs> argument. Oh no, I'm sorry. No, no, not your fault. My friend's fault. Just uh, can't take a hint. No means no. Anyway, let's continue. Okay. So yeah, you probably get to this I divide it into three um, chapters or three chunks. As we're in the anarchy part. Anarchy. But what did you think about that last issue, by the way? Oh shoot. Oh, okay. Nice twist. Uh the king was, was ready to die so that the seeker could be preserved. Not the king, the um the headman man. Oh, okay. I was... <laughs> That's what I meant. I meant the headman was wanting to die so that the seeker could be preserved. Yeah. Oh, geez. The king is now slaughtering these people. Let's Basically, go. we find as we're going on, we're finding out the king is posing himself as the Sakar son, the p protector of the people. Boo. All right. So, yeah, they're trying to they're, they're finding some more of the bugs. Now the bugs are following them. Because they see him as a hero. Hmm. So many younglings. They slow our pace. And someone will need to find more provisions to feed them. And more warriors to protect them. I know just the place. As they're going back to the maw. <laughs> and because they're free, they're able to take over everyone. And, and no, Primus. They'll do what I say. Kill him. Hey, you're all free. Free and to hell with anyone who'd make you a slave again. Primus Van killed my father, and he knows how many. Uh, and who knows how many others he okay. deserve? Uh, others he deserves to die. Then kill him yourself. Thanks, smart talk. I always knew you were smart. I'll tell the emperor. Shut up. I'll do the job myself. Green scar behind you. Drink. Free. Ah. Aww. Aww. It has the no steps. freaking arms. It's no bro. man's land. Protected by the Shadow Treaty, the Empire will not follow us here. And since the Spike War, it's been a wasteland. Nothing growing here but thorns. Nothing lives here but monsters. Sounds like home. Wait! Mia Chiming! Voices in the air! They calling! Calling to us! We have to go back! The governor of the neighbor of Wukar. And that scum suck the headman from the village. The one who killed Miek's hive and enslaved his brothers. Now look at him. That's what we get for letting the, they, these fraternizers and fra fractures live. We won't make the same mistake again. Calm yourself. It's the same trap as before. They'll try to enrage us. Get us into the box canyon. Greenskin? They're crying, Brother Miak. Crying, 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 Brother Bimak. Hush now. Hush. No crying. No more. Just smashing. Warbound. Two hands. Whatever may come. Roar! Now. <laughs> oh, jeez. Greenskin, hold on. Headman, Mia, coming for you. Again? You couldn't kill me before. What makes you saying, wham? Good now. You're just like me. Roar! Mia, it's over. Over? Mia, just starting. Roar! Follow Mia, brother, hero, Mia. Enough. We yield. Mia. Miak, they surrender. Never stop making them pay. Stupid bug. Why? Why you stop stopping me two hands? You should know that already, little one. All I knowing is what he teaching. Oh dear, you're going to see a problem with Miak now, right? No. <laughs> oh boy. As we're seeing Tyre fight him up and soon. Lieutenant. He's killing anything that moves. You have to stop him. Wait, my lord. Permit me. Whoosh. It is over, your grace. They'll bother you no more. But of course they bother me, Shadow. They still live. Now step aside. Your grace. Now, old strong. Your grace. Governor Denobo returns. Where is your armor, Denobo? Where is your army? Like the old rhyme said, he bore mountains on his back. Who, the green scar? He's not the green scar. He's the Sakar son. 
Let it be said throughout the world, I am he, the hero protector, deliverer of the people, the one true son of Sakaar. And you, my shadow, you will destroy all pretenders to my throne. Miak is still mad, but eventually he then sits, and if he sinks over, he then leads into its cocoon state. Now, the reign let some of the people go. Now, they keep on saying, we should, you know, like, saying, like, you can't stop now. We fought for you. You fought for yourself because you bled and the green vines grew because you held mountains on your shoulders. Why do you deny what you are? I know exactly what I am. And if you have any brains at all, you'll shut the hell up and let me walk away before I kill your whole stupid planet. No two hands. You not going anywhere. He's evolved to be just like his dad. Aww. Get out of my way, Miak. He not just Miak no more. Hero Miak, King Miak. Then let me fight him and, and let him fight for you. I'm done. No two hands for killing the Red King. We needing you. Warbound, two hands fighting for friends. Don't you get it? It'll never stop. Two hands. Get your hands off me, you. Get off! Oh, dear. Oh. Oh. You don't listen. Told you I was done. But now I'm I never going to... No, Hulk! Cor Korg, enough. Let me hunt the Red King if he wants. But you, you have to stop. Who are you kidding, Korg? How can he and how can he stopping what he made for doing? So yeah, to find out everything's been a barren wasteland, but more and more people are coming towards them, wanting to follow them because of of Hulk. It's her, the Emperor's Shadow. Fire! Whoa! Archers reload and wait. What do you want? You. If you listened to me before, I could have let you join your friends in the steeps. But now my king demands your head. Buddy, I was coming for him. You've lost a stone, a stone man and your shadow. Your strength and strategy. You lead an army of angry children. Angry's worked pretty good for me so far. You really don't know what you're up against, do you? She basically explains how she, he, she was 13 when he came. All the spikes attacked. Taking out her entire village, her father, her family, everyone. Until eventually the king showed up and saved her. They look like Predator. <laughs> <laughs> and, and putting her and the um, thing on her, the, the control disc on her. I knew the spikes were coming. He knew the spikes were coming. But he let my whole village die just to find a shadow with the all power and make her his slave. He'd kill millions to get to you. You'll kill them anyway. Maybe. But if I kill you first, at least I'll have a chance. I challenge you by the ancient lies of Savage Sakar. Individual combat. What do I get out of this? A fight! Cute. Now, my turn! May he who dies, die well. Rawr! Oh, boy. Just dang. That's awesome, isn't it? Yeah, she blocked his punch and then punched him right back. So that's the old power. You should be dead. You look dead. Let's finish this. Fine by me. Oh. But then, prophet forbid. What is it? The end. Soldiers, retreat. What you got? Another bomb? That's no bomb, Green Scar. It's the spikes. And they basically take over and mutate anyone that they infect. Oh. I, 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 they'll destroy the world. <laughs> Didn't you hear? That's my job. Come on. Ugh. Gross. So these are the spikes. I told you. They mm -hmm. uh, infect anything organic. They could destroy this whole planet. <laughs> they don't look so tough. Don't go anywhere. When I'm done with them, I'm coming back for you. You won't have the chance. Stabs them, and then she's like, fine! 
Goodbye, Green Scar. I love that. She actually does a cannonball position <laughs> to handle it. Hello, word bre- world breaker. Roar! Didn't anyone tell you I'm the strongest one there? Ah! He's already been infected, awesome. but he's able to get it out of him. Ew. <laughs> and but oh geez, Miek needing bigger spears. It's absorbing everything it touches. Back up, bug. I need some room. I've never heard that effect before. Wakum. 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 Oh boy! But soon she gets a message about the um, um, from the king. Your grace, a spike ship has landed. Let loose a salvage spores, infecting my entire platoon. So, so these people, the entire country is at risk. We need death head guards, death fire bombs. Calm yourself, my dear. They're already on their way. All right, your grace, they're two step stones off. They're missing their spikes. In in that case, all strong, all goes as I've decreed. You're trapping this entire village with the spikes. Oh, crap. All these innocent people are getting attacked now, having to deal with them. Green Scar, we'll take your refugees, but you're already here, woman. Now burn me. <laughs> no, not yet. Let the spikes. What? And what? No. <sighs> Thanks. Those were getting starting to itch. Back up, you stupid pinkies. Lieutenant, what are you? Lieutenant, President Mick, King Mick, can you smell it? They soon find a queen. You c- c- came, you chiming, you're calling, never thinking, there still be, never dreaming. You c- 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 queen, hello, my king. But soon they get out, the queen gets stabbed. Now they pull it out from her and seem to save her at first. Um, yes, little king, I live. So, uh, now, you know, like, they're helping get everyone out of there into, um, pot pads. But then, uh, and, like, we've seen you try. You can't kill the Hulk. That's why I released the spikes. What? You? And now you and your precious civilians are getting in the way. Goodbye, old strong. I'm scared. Just close your eyes. Oh, the poor kid. Aww. Now, she survived because of her old power. You and you uh, and you who would be warbound, speak your true name and be bound to us forever. I am Kyera, the old strong, once the emperor's hand. Now I'll fight by your side until we are all, and we all are dead or until I split the king, gold red king from gullet to groin. Works for me. Come here, you stupid pinkies! You tried to kill us with swords and spears. You tried to kill us with bombs. You tried to kill us with your stupid spikes. Please tell me you're getting this. Don't worry, the whole world's getting this. That just made us mad. Made us mad. So get ready, Red King. Now we're coming for you. Bring it on. As we get into issue 100... This has been a great story, hasn't it? Yeah. I can see why it's extremely popular. Yeah, because Hulk is thriving in this. Yeah. And if you notice, this is Hulk. This isn't Banner Hulk. This is Hulk all on his own. Yeah. That's why this is later eventually called the Green Scar Hulk. Ooh, I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what they're calling him. It's Green Scar. No, I mean his outfit. Oh. <laughs> So now that some people are telling the story about Green Scar coming down and everything, but um, uh oh, more of the spikes are coming. And but Hulk starts smashing it, causing a bit of an eruption to occur. Spikes don't surf. That's such a great shot. Yep. So as soon as they get out of there, um, Old Strong falls. Hulk grabs her, and then um. A Makong and Makong. <laughs> we always just call them lava monsters. You fought them before, smashed one in the maw. But this one's wild. He's defending, just defending his territory. By killing us? Not likely. What? 
Look out for t look out, two hands, Korg. <laughs> It'll be tough for him to top that on a second date. What's a date? That's awesome, isn't it? Unfortunately, though, the queen was still infected. And even says, our time is past. Now, first, um, Hulk saying we should do it, and then he does it. Basically now, Mia and his entire race are doomed. All strong. The time has come. We must get our people. Call on the Shadow Elders. It's useless, Hiriam. We're Oathbreakers. Anathema. No, they will listen, and they will help. Because of him. Forget it. I don't need your crummy. Even you cannot do this alone. You must come. Whatever he, and wherever he goes, the spikes follow. Do you want to wipe out your own people, Hiram? The spikes will reach us it was them regardless. He must come. Because the shelter, shadow elders will only joy if they, in the fight if they believe. Believe what? Their blasphemous folly. That he is the one they've been calling. That he is the healer. The savior. The Sakar son. Hulk, not Sakar son. Sakar son is Miak. I know the old rhymes. Unite us and destroy us. Hero Miak. King Miak. He is the Sakar son and the world bringer. He has delivered us and destroyed us forever. Miak. Not the Sakar son. Not the world breaker. Just Miak. But you right, little brother. We delivering and destroying. We living new life. But already we dying dead. So we going. Leading the spikes away. Fighting for friends. Those puny pinkies killing us, brothers. Now we killing them back. Such great characters, right? Yeah. You don't really hate anybody here. <laughs> no, you, no, you don't. Even if they're jerks. You still like yeah. it because you understand why they're jerks. Exactly. So yeah, they speak about the um, uh, the prophets lost and you know, walking and all that. Um, yeah, and everything as they make their way there, and we find out here is why Hiram is called Hiram. You know, like why he's known what he's known as, because he truly thought he was the Sakar son, and he grew up thinking that. But then my master sat before me. And stared into my eyes, and he knew. I tore away, knocked my master to the ground, and so I earned the name, Hiriom the Shame. For the prophet entreats us to be like the Sarkarsa, but to dream as I did of actually being him. Blasphemy. And now I must pray for forgiveness all over again. Because I send you, Hulku, to chase my old forbidden dream. But even more shamefully, I dare to hope you might actually fulfill it. Sakar, Sakar, son, hear my cry. Let me dream again. Up oh, here's a backup story with um, um, Amadeus. Amadeus Cho. Basically, he he's a guy who can actually read, you know, see all, all the connections and everything. He is a genius, one of the highest genius in the Marvel universe. And as they're telling him, he's discovered that Hulk isn't on the planet they sent him. And as he points out, Hulk will eventually come back and he'll be angry, just like always. And he calls him out saying, look at all the stuff he's done and yet you say, sent him away? <laughs> oh, here's an old issue. Yeah, this is the 100th issue, so they're adding in some old stories. Oh, come on. You can't do a specific number, right? No, I, 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 well, let's see if I can't. Oh, it doesn't even say the page number. Is that no, Matt I'm almost, I'm almost done. I'm almost done. You can see by the red bar. There we go. Now, how many more issues do we have left? Oh, we're almost done. We got five more issues left. Come on, come on. There we go. Oh, wow. Hulk's fighting his way through everything. You're Kyra, the old strong. 
Yes, First Helter, you serve the Emperor. No longer. Then you have broken the Shadow Treaty. You bring doom upon your people. The Emperor released the spike. He brings doom upon us all. You must go. You must mend the rip. The oath which cannot be broken. Can you not see, Elder? He is come. First Elder, he looks like... I know. Looks like who? Whoa! Frat, what just when it was getting good? What is this? The ancient vessel that brought the Shadow People here from our world. We are lost, far from home, but this planet nurtured us, and so we strive to serve her. We have only traces of the old power left in our blood, sometimes not enough. So we fired up the ancient engines, and we created the Great Portal. It brought the Death's Head guards, who fought back the first Spike invasion. It brought the Silver Surfer, who freed the slaves. And finally, it brought you. Why? Here on the shame calls of blasphemers. You are. But we believe the old stories. The Sakar Sun will come to all the people of this planet to save us and unite us. The prophet and the prophet tells us the Sakar Sun lies within each of us. But you chose to look outward, scurve and scourging the universe for a savior of flesh and bone. So now you have found him, and you must obey when he calls. Not so fast, child. Your friend may look the part, but he hasn't passed the test. The t test? I don't think so. Why? Are you frightened? Oh! <laughs> Hi. Prepare yourself for the ritual of provocation in the Saka. Right. Yeah, you, you call them your friends, but they challenged you. They fought you, and they would do it again because you're a monster. Yeah, but so are they. Look deeper, Green Scar. So basically now he's having another vision with all of his people. How can you unite when your heart is so full of hate? You are not the Sakar son. Doesn't matter. With your help, he can stop the spikes. He can save millions of people who... You must go. Whatever. I got what I came for. He wanted their ship. All right, we're clear. Blast them, Miak, now! Miak, what are you waiting for? Wait, little brother. And brother, who's that talking? Not talking. Someone, something, Kimming. You've lost your queen. You've lost everything. Miak, now, now give yourselves over to us. Not listening, stupid spikes. Lying, lying, lying! Oh, crack me. Stupid puny pinkies. <laughs> Let's see what you've got. And we could be riding inside, you know. These missiles can't hurt the stone starship of the shadow people. Yeah, but this is more fun. Status, Archie. Oh, his name's Archie. Give me half a second, Hiram. I'm booting up a thousand-year-old weapon system here. All right. We're in. Rerouting portal energy to forward guns. EMP effect warming up. And it's raining dre and depowered Imperial Dreadnoughts. All right. Next stop, Crown City. Now, you fools! Are you deaf? The Emperor says now. Just one moment, Your Grace. They're using some kind of electromagnetic pulse. It'll shut down every machine in the city. But we think we can prote and protect your armor if we just... Lights out, pinkies! What does this remind you of? To save us and unite us. Green Scar! Green Scar! Green Scar! Not so fast. Too much cheering. Time now for fighting. Killing the rest of them in Crown City before they killing us. The Pinkies can't touch us now. No power, no bombs. We got another job now. You can smell it, can't you, Miek? They're calling to you. Chemming. Yeah, stupid spikes. Let's go. Hurry up. We have to stop them. There are sounds of the spikes on the other side of that fire. Even he... Eloway, do you forget? He's the Hulk. Like, they're waiting for us, and they're waiting for us. Careful, Green Skin. I'm getting stronger all the time. The spikes can't cut me now. But they won't stop trying. Ready to throw that bomb? We're going to. We're not going to fight them. What? You heard me. I heard you. I just don't. Two hands. Where are you? Spikes are coming them up, eating them. No, the spikes let them through. Two hands. I can chem them, Hulk. They're calling for you. They want you inside the ship. Can't trust these stupid little spikes. Two hands. What you hoping to find in there? Big spikes. So those are their elders. <laughs> um, 
Oh, geez. So, um, they basically say now, they say the Red King days are over. They say it's time for a queen. <gasps> ah, fools! That's it. We're going all the way, brothers, to the palace! All right, we, we brought you, I mean, we brought her, your grace, just as you. Thank you, Senator. Always satisfying cleaning house, isn't it? Now then, LOA, Caffey, the high blood traitor to the Empire, do you prove incineration or decapitation? How about option three? Kicking your ass! So they convinced the big spikes to listen. Nice. Oh! What are they? Spikes. Not just spikes, all strong. Spikes fathers. What did that you do with that bomb, Greenskin? Not gonna need it. Hulk, you know that the spikes do the soft skins. We have to stop them now. You can hear them, huh, Miak? Yes, spikes talking, chumming with Miak, telling stories, sending memories, calling out. Show us. Basically, yeah, they were st stuck there, sent there, and basically they went insane because they have, if they don't have energy, they can't control themselves. So they lash out and just absorb anything. But they belong to the stars. And everything, your children, Stop. your children threaten our people. They're hungry, so hungry. But for a little, a little while, we can control them. We can help you if you help us. So yeah, they're going in now with the um, spikes helping them. It's a big fight. Miek, right here, two hands. I want you to chum all of us with him. So when I beat him to death, he'll know why. <sighs> what do you want from me? Tears for these slaves? For these monsters? Yes, I killed them. As is my right. As is my duty. As is my pleasure. Ha! I can st see you still bleed. Stupid. That just makes me mad. And the madder I get, the stronger I get. <laughs> now I'm mad too. Not mad enough. All right, Green Scar. One last chance. Kneel down before me, tear the hair from your head, uh, 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 head, lick the dirt at my feet, and beg me eight times to stay my royal wrath, or I'll burn every soul you ever tried to save. You're dead. No, you are! What's going on? The Red King, he's killed us all. Greenskin, Korg, hold the little guy a moment. Farewell, Hulku. What's she talking, what's she talking about? I'm an old strong. This planet talks to me. It cannot hold. The Great King has cracked this planet. What did he Hulk do? He jumps in and pulls it together. Ooh! Impossible. He he shifted the very place. Of course he did. He's the Hulk. But you said he couldn't. I was just making him mad. He seems <laughs> to work best that way, right, Green Skin? skin? Er, took the words right out of my mouth. Rawr! Green Skin, or today you die. Let's go. Ah, what the frat is that? A whereby? Run! No, wait. It's dead. Come on, we'll strip it for parts. Stupid slaves. I'm no will to bot. I'm the hero, protector, the crown prince, the red king, the emperor of the car. I am God in flesh and blood, and you cannot touch me. Ah! You serve the red king. Now you hold it, LOA. It is done. Wait, hear them. The spikes, they're all around us. Get the death's head laser cannons now before... Calm yourself, child. The spike elders fought by our side, kept their children back, as they promised. What are you talking about? They're monsters. We have to enact now all, or... Monsters? Only the real monsters on this planet is dead. The Red King? The war is over. Green Scar! Green Scar! Let the peace begin. Hulku? What's all that noise? They're celebrating. Celebrating what? Your coronation. Your bright idea? Greenskin, you know me, Korg. You're why, hey, why are you? Why are you doing this? Because I know you. The many different people of the world together, only you have the strength. They're absorb. They're draining the Hulk. And only you have the will. Forgive us, Green Scar. So hungry. Forgive us. Hulku. While the spike elders feed on him, the spike children outside are quiet. 
but he can't possibly bear every bird of this world, says who? Aw. May the prophet preserve you, you mm -hmm. King Hulk. <gasps> King Hulk. Yep. Hulku, why do you do this? The spikes have been feeding on you for seven hours. Even you can't do this. I'm the Hulk. I can take anything. Urgh. Hulku, it's all right, Sayera. As long as they feed off him, no one else dies. Him? I mean me. Thank you, Greed Scar. They'll pass my, his energy, his, my energy to the spikes outside. Urgh. So for another day. They won't have to feed on anyone else. Now, how about some breakfast? <laughs> oh boy, people are still, um, in the name of the emperor. Your emperor is dead, just like you. Get killing out of the way. Thanks, Miek. Now let's do some more. To the Senate, and no mercy for the loyalists. Spare us, please. Why would why should we spare you? You supported the Red King when he killed Salzus. Even now you raise arms against LOA? Mother! Kill them all! No! What are you doing? She's my mother, Miek! Your mother helping the your mother helping the Emperor's people. There must be some re but the Emperor's people killed your father. He died in the Maw. It's true, mother. I saw it. I know. Then what are you doing? The Emperor was insane. He had to go. But we're still blooded Imperials. This world belongs to us, not the bugs. Yeah, that's how you thinking, how you true being, how many of us you slaving, how many of us you killing. Now we killing you back. No! Pinkies, bugs, punks! Let me go to Anne. She's stabbing my brother for cutting my mother. Enough, LOA. The war is over. We're building a nation now. Yeah. A nation for the puny pinkies. The burial's killing us for years and years. Now they have to go. Now they have to die. And you're ready to slaughter them in cold blood? You happy doing it before. Remember Primus Van? You cut his throat while he cried for mercy. Like you said to hands, never stop making them pay. Touch my mother and I'll never stop making you pay. Fine. We'll do it your way. They're all in the great arena. Everyone starts to fight, but then Hulk shows up. Fight! 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 You want to fight? Fight me! But when they all do it, come on! The fight is over. We are all warbound now. Embrace your brothers, or I'll kill you myself. Two hands. New world indeed. So in other words, he forced them to fight them so that they all, everyone became warbound. So now they have to work together. What does war bound even mean? Those who are joined together in a fight. They oh. will fight until the end. Oh, he tricked him. <laughs> yep. And basically saying, like, he, we will now give you a shadow guard. I, no, no shadow guard. I want a queen. Hulku. I believe we have ourselves a treaty. I am shadow for, I'm shadow. For this marriage to be true... We must complete the shadow ceremony. Will you kneel with me as I kneel with you? I will. You will. Will you burn with me as I burn with you? I will. And will you bear your body and soul to me as I bear mine to you? Halku, I must know you. All of you. Show me. All right. Who? I'm Bruce. You asked, so Hulk let me out. He wanted you to see me. All of him. All of us. All of me. She doesn't care! Nice. Oh. So the Peakies get their queen, but two hand forgetting. Forgetting us. Forgetting our queen dying and forgetting himself. Forgetting what he's made for. He's supposed to be angry, smashing, revenging. Maybe it's time for forgetting. No! Come now. Here in the dark, here in the warmth, my little Miak. Ooh! So those two get together! Uh, that's a female? Broods are all female. Oh. And they activate the ship. What's this? Humans. 
Humans? This must be the Hulk's shuttle, the ship that brought them to him to Earth. Then those, those are his friends. Now he'll remember. Oh dear. So basically, as you already guessed, Hulk is the happiest he's ever going to be. Everything's going well for him. Unfortunately, oh, yes. look at this title, Armageddon. Oh. Ooh. Need a bigger bed. <laughs> Two hands, can you hear me? Basically, he shows him the message and he punches it. Sorry, it's all right. The old upper did that all the time. Two hands. Where were you, husband? Shh. Wait, where are... Oh! The steeps. What are we doing here, husband? You told me once this was a place of peace. That if I went in there, I'd never have to fight again. What are you saying, Hulku? Maybe... Maybe we should just go. I'll go wherever you want. But there's no need for this. You don't have to fear yourself. You don't understand. They call me the Sakaar son, the savior, but I know what I am. The world breaker, the destroyer of all. Look out over the steeps, Hulku. We fought on this land, remember? You bled here, and now look at that what grew from your blood, and tell me you broke this world. You don't want to run away. You don't want to be left alone, because this is where you belong, with your people, with your queen, with your child. <gasps> And so everything is going good. Two hands. What's going on? The war is over. Now we make peace. The Red King is dead, but his enemies still surround. Hero and Crow, you go to the Philians, negotiate a treaty. Archie, you're going into the Twisted Wood to talk to the Wildabots. Oh, France. And Mia Canelloway, you're going to help me with the spikes. But first, we got some cleaning to do. Can you believe this? That Hulk is actually doing a great job as a ruler. From what I saw before? Yeah, I can believe it. Now they're gathering up an old ship, the Spike's old ship, repairing it, and now they're going back into the stars. So yeah, they're going home now. And then, um, but right when it looks like things are getting bad, Hulk jumps up to help them. As they help out with their people, or their others out in space, bringing them forth, and then as they're heading off, then um, they're going to be living on the moon now. And then Hulk starts heading back in for re-entry. Hulku, something fell from the sky, but I can't see anything through the smoke. It's all right, Korg. In fact, it's perfect. Aww. <laughs> So yeah, they're having over there, and uh, the uh, uh, they brought in the Hulk's old ship. And look, make the image of the Hulk coming out. Hulku smash! Just smile, husband. Just smile. <laughs> what do we do now? Now we just live. Beep 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 beep. Time and time again, your anger and power have threatened the entire planet. Warning: warp core compromise. Move! Stupid puny humans! Everyone get down! Hulku? <sighs> Crap! Oh my gosh, no. Protect the baby. And so yeah, they're talking with the will, the bots. He explains everything of what seems to be going on, but then... Boom! They, and this is just day three of the um, Korean King's reign. Don't worry, Hoku. I will never leave you. Oh, jeez. We start seeing Eloise talking with her mother, who's actually getting along with the bugs. All right, Popeye. Read them and weep. That's a load of... Hey, watch it. There's a lady in the room. Ha! <laughs> oh, what is it? Don't worry. The green scar will protect... Ah! Cool my my eyes, warm my heart. Let me dream again. Younglings, to me! Get down, you damn, you dumb pinky! Oh, geez, they're actually hearing from her mother. Hush, child, there's no time. Listen, I'm an all proud woman, and I only say this once. Your world, you and your friends were making, it was a good thing. Mother, oh, daughter, I don't want to. 
Oh, jeez. Hiram, what happened? Could you see? It was the humans. Their shuttle exploded. They make their way in, trying to find everyone. They use the Shadow People's ship to get them up, and everything's getting worse. All right, the people said, the people said I was the Sakar son. I could and, I, and come to save them and unite them. But I was the world breaker all along. I just didn't know you were too. Stupid humans with your stupid shuttle. Can't you do anything right? I want to die. I want to burn into nothing. But with your bomb, you just made me stronger. The strongest one there is. The only one is it there is. Give them back! Give them back! Give her back. Oh, crapper doodles. Two hands. Leave me alone. No, Hulku. We are war bound to the end. Look around you, Hiram. This is the end. Nothing left to save. Nothing even left to smash. Maybe not here. But the robot has a map of the whole universe in his brain. I bet there's some you can figure out some place you'd like to go. This is the story of the Green Scar, the Eye of Anger, the World Breaker, Har and Harkonnen, Harag, Holku, Hulk, and now he finally came home. Well. Uh, I didn't want to get depressed. <laughs> but there's one more thing we're going to go over. If you give me a moment. Do, 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 do. There was a what if issue. What? It asked a few questions, all written by Greg Pack, some sillier than others. Well, at least one is sillier than the others. We asked three questions. What if the Hulk di and died and Tyra left Peaceful Planet? And what if Bruce Banner had landed instead of um, Hulk? So we're basically seeing everything, <laughs> everything, everything what happened up to World War Hulk and everything. But this, instead of taking it, Hulk's threw Sierra away. And it turned out it was Sierra that helped save him. If she wasn't there, he dies. Husband. So Sierra survived. Sierra, where? Where's the Hulk? I could have saved him. It's my old power. But he saved me instead. Wait! No, no, no! No! Yes, the plant speaks to me. He is gone. But he's he's Hulk! Nothing can kill him! Ah, he's coming! Miak, come back! Two ants! I knew you would live! And he gets killed by the lava! Ooh. Miak! Oh, oh, angry planet. What you doing? Bear witness, Korg. She is the old strong. Her planet power her power comes from the planet itself. Now she gives it back. They healed what the humans have broken. No. Now I take it all! By the prophet. Bring the ship. We're going to Earth! So she's absorbed the power of a planet. Yeah, kill everybody on Earth. And then she, what's the but not she Hulk, keep her alive. <laughs> what and what do we see? She smash cracks the moon. Oh no, um, Iron Man, Mister Fantastic, Doctor Strange. You shot him into space. Then you killed our whole world. I am Tyera the Old Strong, widow of the Green King, and I will kill you all. She then enslaved um, Black Bolt and uses him to kill Sentry and Doctor Strange. She then comes in and kills everyone else and then enslaves the rest. She takes down Mr. Fantastic, chops off Iron Man's head. Everyone comes in, and yet he uh, she takes them out, including She-Hulk, no. sadly. She May he who dies. That he had green skin. Wait, wait, all strong. The guilty have paid. And now the guilty have paid. Now you only hurt the innocent. No one is here is innocent. I'm gonna carry carry this continent in half, and no one on this planet can stop you. But if you kill all these humans, who will live to honor your husband? You're clever, Shadow Priest. Fine, but they'll wish they were dead. 
21 years later. Mother, it's done. Finally. They made a statue for a Hulk. And that's that's um Scar, but we don't but this is just a tease of him. She didn't go she was his warbound, his lover, his queen. She then turned herself the stone in his hand, and she will never leave him. That was sad. It was kind of cool, though. Now this is what if Bruce landed on the planet he was sent to. And uh, it's like he breaks out. Humans! He tried to jump out, but nope, couldn't make it. Stomps around, sees some cr ant critters and pets them. Eat some of the food. Eep! Back off! Eep! Ha! Eep! Eep! Oh my god! Alright, alright. Now for some. Eep! Food! No. No! Roar! What? Where? He smashed his home. Fine. You think that's funny? Let's see how you like this, you stupid monster! Fine! Let's see how like you like this, you punk! Ah, oh, nuts. And this way, dummy. <laughs> Yours, mine. Fine. Eep. Eep, eep. <sighs> they basically, they know to stay on the Hulk side. He actually makes a... Like, this is Bruce Banner. Repeat, this is Bruce Banner. Is there anyone listening? Bruce Banner, this is Bruce Banner. Is there anyone listening? Damn it! This wasn't part of the deal! Rassin' frassin'. Cheater! Eep! Eep! <laughs> they They actually made statues of the Hulk. Eep! Eep, 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 eep! Or Hulk made them. Eep! He realizes they want him to protect them. He was a god who fell from the skies when the world was young. He could have raised his mighty voice, summoned the other gods to carry him away. But he saw us when we were blind and dumb, small and weak, nothing but, and but food for the dragons, doomed to extinction. And he loved us, and he will always be there to protect us. That's the story, anyway. Grandpa says it's, just, it's not just a story. Well, Grandpa also says the giant snakes still live in the jungle. They don't? I don't see anything back there, do you? Let's go, son. Okay, he was the Hulk, and his soul will never stop paying for his rage. But tonight we sleep and dream, and we know there was always another way. Just realize his pants isn't that purple. Hmm. And here's a joke. He lands there. He dies. Everyone keeps heading over there. They die. Yeah, that seems legit. I knew it. <laughs> Okay, so what did you think about all of that? Oh, it was great. It was so sad, too. It was, wasn't it? Yeah. Poor Hulk. I mean, yeah. Everything bad always happens to Hulk. But, what, but over, the artwork was incredible. Okay, who's your favorite of the Warbound? I'm guessing Miak, right? Or Meek? Mmm. Nah, I like the girl who always is trying to fight. Eloway, Eloway. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, why'd you like about her? Because she's always trying to fight people. Mine was always Hiriam. I liked him best. I can see how he's he can be popular. But I love Sayera most of all. You could definitely see why she was perfect for the Hulk. Yeah, she was great. And that's why I love that one story in the Giant Size where Bert Banner tried to remind him saying. Hulk loved Jarella, but it's like, no, Bruce was in control. She loved Bruce, not Hulk. So we finally met someone that loved Hulk and actually didn't care about Banner. She didn't mind him. And that's the great stuff. But so tragic. But you can probably guess what happened with there. No way mm -hmm. in hell would the ship be that have that powerful of a warp core, would it? Nah. But, now, what did you think about Miek or Brood or Krog? Would you say Krog was better here than he was in any of the movies? 
The movies. He was in the movies. He was in um, Ragnarok and um, Love and Thunder. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's a complete <laughs> joke in there. Yeah. And Mia gets a punching bag in that. Yeah, I did not like those. They were the worst part of the movies for me. But they were much better here, weren't they? Yeah. Though I will say that for Infinity, was it Infinity War or Endgame? Them talking about the, the some noob, <laughs> noob sixty nine guy. Oh, that was Endgame. <laughs> yeah, that part was at least funny to me. Yeah, but um, but Krog, but Krog, I like, but. Again, all such great characters all around. The Red King, what an asshole! Yeah, what the heck? So, would you give this a 10? I'm giving it a 10. Very good. So, next time we'll be back with World War Hulk. Yee. We'll see you guys then.